Well, first of all, I really feel that in the dictionary and encyclopedia of dance, there should be a Michael Jackson technique, um, just because all of us grew up watching him, and when you go out to any country, any place in the world, once you see someone do a Michael Jackson movement, it's just everyone identifies that's Michael Jackson. With Michael, I think what he brought to the world was just, first of all, the ability to mesh the street dance, raw street dance, your popping styles, your locking styles, uh, your b-boy, b-girl styles, and putting it in um, with um, te technical dance. When you watch the videos, you really see how the choreographer and Michael were able to execute the fusion of the two, which is pretty breakthrough, um, especially for a street dancer. When you look at Michael, what you see is a standard of excellence. You see precision, you see execution, you see specific placement. Um, everything is like a piece of art. When I rewatched the video, I was like, oh my gosh, there's nothing out there like this anymore. Um, just this amazing um, art and movement. I took inspiration from that. I was like, I want to be precise like Michael. I want to put emotion into Michael. I want to put soul and feeling into this dance. I was actually um, kind of crying when I was creating the piece because there was so much emotion in it. So um, I took this classic piece and just, um, again, put it in my own style because I'm trained in uh, like funk styles and whacking. Put it into the whole Michael feel and fused everything together along with my own just kind of personal style and kind of create this whole piece. Mathematics.